Frank Frazetta. I asked for some ideas for style challenges and Frank Frazetta's name came up a few times and you don't have to ask me twice, well, maybe three times. <laughs> but yeah, let's do Frank Frazetta today. My favorite painting of his is the Egyptian Queen for obvious reasons. I tried getting that oil paint quality once before in Photoshop, but it didn't really work out. I'm trying a new technique now. I recently started using the vector shapes in Photoshop and then uh, putting a mask over it and then painting on that mask. So I'm gonna use that technique. This is a little trial. Then adding a canvas filter. And looks, yeah, looks pretty good. So let's see what we're gonna draw. It will be Frank Frazetta woman, of course. And the pose. Thought about doing a little head tilt with sunglasses, but then decided on just normal standing pose. Frazetta gives me like 80s vibes, so let's give her short hair. And then try to pick some aspects from the Egyptian queen layout. Like a circle in the back, big pillar. I think because I love that Largo winch cover, that this design kind of came to me naturally. But uh, yeah, okay. So laying out all the vector shapes, putting a mask on all the vectors. I think this whole drawing took about three and a half hours, so let's speed it up. Blocking out the parts, picking the colors from the original painting for the skin tone. I'm using masks over vector shapes then filling them with a brush and then blending the brush together with the smudge tool so that's what i keep using And in the end, I merged all the layers. The smudge tool is very useful because if you use a hard tip, you can just like bend the curves of the body of the shapes. But if you use a soft tip, then you can blend the colors together. So you can almost draw with your finger kind of. Then the background, um, I, w I was thinking of drawing the marble, but then I found that the pattern overlay water filter makes it look really like marble already. So that literally only took like five minutes to do those pillars and stones. And put a color filter over it to get it to that orangey feeling. Try to make the woman a little bit more beautiful. And here we go. Challenge accepted. A modern update of Frank Frazetta. This woman's like a 10 out of 10. Mine's like a, like a 6. I would give her a 6. 
about it. This is an interesting technique. I think I will uh, experiment with it more. But the biggest lesson from this is that I have to make the underlying line art tighter and so that the woman is prettier. Thank you for the idea and uh, hope you enjoyed it. Keep those ideas coming and see you next time.